Welcome to SafeCalculation.com or any inquiry you might email us SafeCalculation at gmail.com WhatsApp slash call plus 6628211448 Today topic is lifting pad eye lock split set calculation So this lifting lock detail is uh, uh, carry the pencil is something uh, like this the okay this this is the pencil this is the lifting lock okay and then this one is the rope so uh, based on the this information you have to get the material out lock this one using the material uh, mild steel a36 and then the yield stress is the 235 so you can change to make it higher 355 so depends on your calculation uh, at the moment we are using 235 and then the weight of the pencil is 221 uh, ton is a 221.733 uh, kilonewton by the way and this one is the sling angle so the sling angle using is a 60 degree side wing is the 5 degree so the pin diameter is the 57.15 uh, number of lug is the 4 uh, safety factor is uh, 2.43 uh, based on the disc the safety factor for lifting uh, the, this is the criteria so let's say the tolerance factor of aging in accuracy is 1.03 variation of COG is 1.1 dynamic amplification factor is 1.5 your effect factor is 1.05 so consequency uh, factor is 1.35 so it's a total is a uh, 2.43 so this one is the this one is the dimension so dimension of the uh, pedai the uh, the lock the lock right so the main plate thickness is supporting mm so you can change uh, this one based on the uh, based on the your dimension uh. Uh, so at the moment I'm using this one because this is the same with my uh, my lock so you can change this one and then the pillet well around chick plate also this one is a 20 mm pillet well around lock to pad is a 60 mm so the maximum allow well uh, welding stress is the 9600 psi okay this is the allowable stress for lock so the allowable tension uh, getting some one uh, it's a mass of one for one newton per millimeter square the allowable sear is 194 newton per millimeter square and then the allowable bending 1.51 uh, allowable bearing is a 211.5 okay this is the formula from the uh, rules uh, either using the which any rules in classification either bbdmp or abs or ESCC okay this one is uh, just now is a safety factor so from this the law the law for luck here we have to get is a 11 point uh, 253 uh, kilonewton based on the disc the uh, uh, tangents 5 degree so resultant force we getting is a 1.148.95 kilonewton so the allowable load on well is a uh, 66.1 the welding size so the lock well parameter is uh, getting 680 so the stress is uh, in lock is uh, uh, getting is only the 35.87 newton per millimeter uh, this one is a bending and then the bending set axis is this one so the tension getting is uh, only the 10 10.71 uh, newton per millimeter the utility check is uh, not more than a uh, one so this one is uh, acceptable because the utility check is not more than the no one right so this is the formula this the formula also is a uh, is automatic so you don't need to change anything so you just change the all the red color one only okay now uh, check on the stress in luck right check in, in stress in luck uh, tensile force uh, getting 189 uh, sear force uh, 109 uh, sear force 6.5 so all these item uh, this uh, formula is automatic so you don't need to change also and then the resulting uh, post uh, resultant, resultant post so you get in 500 this one is a resulting bending boss so based on this 
selected is a 20 uh, mm so the minimum well size 8.33 but you are using 20 mm so it's a sufficient stress at pinhole of black also uh, i have to double check the seal area and then this is stress so the stress stress is uh, is only 13.89 newton per millimeter square uh, it's uh, less than the uh, allowable uh, allowable seal stress okay so this one is okay and also we have to check the bearing stress so the bearing stress uh, stress also is the less than then uh, from the allowable uh, stress uh, allowable bearing stress so we get is only 32.5 uh, newton per millimeter square so it's okay now we check stress in the lock uh, to sell well in in sell well right the reinforcement pad detail uh, this one is a reinforcement on the pad detail it's like the doubler okay it's so like the doubler this one so uh, you can change uh, based on your uh, double size so attached to the cell well uh, attached to the main at the main deck or any other area so and uh, you need to double check the seal force also and then the bending force so uh, getting from uh, this uh, the minimum well size is here is a 2.88 but we are using set up for uh, fillet well is a uh, 22 this one is a minimum so the punching sear a uh, punching sear uh, the punching sear also we have to double check so the punching sear uh, is only 1.608 is not more than than this uh, the allowable stress uh, this is the eyelet eyelet so this is the eyelet uh, size for double is 400 and then this the eyelet is a 301 this is 40 so they using the uh, chick place is a uh, 20 mm okay so this the isla is uh, acceptable to carry the weight of the uh, the weight of the pestle a small pestle is at uh, around 21 ton only uh, okay so don't forget to subscribe to our youtube channel uh, safe calculation com if you need safe calculation and ship design drawing you might contact us at the following email sipcalculation at gmail.com whatsapp slash call plus uh, 62 office call plus 62 you might need to get more information on this so uh, you can visit our website www.sipcalculation.com thank you very much for watching see you again bye bye